Hi, this is Ron the Dream Roper McLean. Back to you now. We've been talking about seniorhood and what your, are your options, and we've been talking about different business options you can pursue. But I want to talk today about branding, so stay tuned. Branding could be critical to your business. Let's talk to you in a minute. Okay, branding. Why is branding important? Well, when you think of branding, you think maybe Coca-Cola or Ford Motor Company or, or a lot of advertisers. I'm not talking about that type of branding. If you're uh, a solopreneur or a home business owner or a small business owner, what I'm, I'm uh, promoting that you do is brand you, brand yourself. Because, as you know, businesses fail, and there's a high failure rate in business, and you might end up doing something different than when you started out. But if you're branding you, and if you develop a following, you're going to be able to adapt to a different business plan much easier. Because businesses fail, you're still here. Because wherever you go, there you are, right? And uh, also, it gives you an authority. Um, if people will will look at your blog, they see you have skills, abilities, talents. Uh, you provide value. If you if you provide value to them, value to them, if, if they're trying to make a decision on what to buy, and you're out there providing value, branding you, they'll gravitate to you, and it gives you a reputation as well uh, that your name means something. Now. Uh, I personally believe in blogging, because obviously you're seeing this on a blog. Um, on blogging, you need to provide value. Value to whom? Well, value to your target market, the people that, that you really want to uh, talk to in your business. People that uh, generally share, share what you, what's important to you. So, how do you do that? You provide value to them. And... I'm not talking on a blog that you're going to go put an advertisement every day, every day, every day. That's almost like turning on the TV and watching advertisement after advertisement after advertisement. How quick are you going to switch that channel? So, what you want to do is spread value, value, value. And you can interject a sales message because, hey, you're in business. You can also put a link to a sales page because we're talking electronic media here on blogging. You can do that very easily. And if you have established the value of you and what you're doing, your target audience is going to be interested in taking a look at it. And it gives you the authority. And it, it again, it separates you from the competition. People can see you, they see a face, they know who you are, and people do business with people they know, like, and trust. So build that relationship. Build that relationship with your audience, with your customers, and let them see that you are a person of value. I hope this helped you. And if it did, feel free to like and share. And I'm going to um, put a link in there how to contact me. And, and come back and visit because then I'm doing a series of posts on here and, and what are your choices for if you live in seniorhood. So uh, Ron McLean, the Dream Roper. Come on back and see us, ronmcclain.com. And you have a richly blessed day.